गुरु दर्पण लाइफ स्केच ऑफ म्यूजिशियंस बाय वृंदा अग्नि पंडित हरिप्रसाद चौरसिया पंडित हरिप्रसाद चौरसिया वॉज बॉर्न ऑन जुलाई फर्स्ट 1938 इनटू अ फैमिली ऑफ रेसलर्स His mother died when he was 6 and the young lad grew up in the akhada. His father had dreams of his son following his footsteps. But young Hari Prasad was never interested in the ancient form of wrestling, kushti. He said, "I was not any good at wrestling. I went there only to please my father. But maybe because of the strength and stamina I built up then, I am able to play the basuri even to this day." an internationally acclaimed flautist of india pandit hari prasad chaurasia is a very popular and eminent artist par excellence who is known for his outstanding contribution in popularizing indian classical music all over the world unlike many other great indian artists pandit hari prasad chaurasia does not come from a family of musicians rather music is a path he found for himself and struggled very hard to overcome all the hurdles that came his way to emerge successful with a sheer grit sincerity hard work devotion and dedication he came from a rather traditional family that believed that music was practiced by only courtesans it was an era when that was the reigning belief and many of the outstanding musicians of that time were from the devdasi or the courtesan tradition hari prasad used to lie to his family to go and learn music he would tell them he was going to the temple when he was busy following his passion for the basuri born in allahabad he began his musical pursuit at the age of 15 learning classical vocal techniques from pandit raja ram jaiswal within a year he however had switched to flute playing after listening to pandit bholanath prasanna a noted flautist from varanasi he tutored under pandit bholanath prasanna for 8 years in 1957 barely out of his teens he became regular staff artist of all india radio katak in odisha where he worked as a performer as well as a composer from here on began his musical journey that took him all over the globe transferred by all india radio katak to mumbai in 1960 he received further guidance from surbahar player shrimati annapurna devi the daughter of baba alauddin khan and a musician in her own right many believe that she was the finest musician of her generation annapurna devi made hari prasad ji wait for 3 years to judge his dedication to music and then accepted him as a student her only condition was that he unlearn what he had hitherto learned and start with a clean slate approaching music with total bhakti as a complete novice Hari Prasad Chaurasia agreed and says of this to show her i was serious i decided to switch hands i used to play with my right hand i switched to the left it's like if i tell you that instead of walking straight walk backwards for the rest of your life without looking back he later said of her shrimati annapurna devi ji is my guru she is my mother she is my teacher she is everything for me she is more than a goddess under her guidance his music acquired a new dimension and he left air to pursue his performing career since that time pandit hari prasad chaurasia has been performing nationally and internationally winning acclaim from varied audiences and fellow musicians like yehudi menuhin Jean Pierre Rampal among others he tours regularly in the US and Europe 
and is a featured artist in almost all music major festivals around the globe. Some of his achievements and recognitions include the Sangeet Natak Academy Award in the year 1984, the Maharashtra Gaurav Puraskar in the year 1990, Konark Samman and Padma Bhushan in 1992, Yash Bharti Samman in 1994, Kalidas Samman in 1999, Ustad Hafiz Ali Khan Award and the Padma Vibhushan in 2000, Master Dinanath Mangeshkar Award in the year 2004. He has also received the Sangeet Natak Academy Fellowship Award in the year 2012. As a musician, Pandit Hari Prasad Chaurasia is a rare combination of an innovator and a traditionalist. He has significantly expanded the expressive possibilities of classical North Indian flute playing through his masterful blowing technique. and his unique adaptation of alap and jor to the flute he is an immensely popular artist in india and abroad pandit hari prasad chaurasia's horizon also extend beyond north indian classical music to the indian folk and popular music and to western music as well he is indeed an inspiration and role model to many flautists of today's generation thank you